Deer hunting season in the low country is officially here. Now, if you didn't know, South Carolina has the longest firearm season in the country, so there's plenty of time to get out there, but make sure you're obeying the law. You must have a hunting license to hunt and or, of course, harvest a deer. And one step in obtaining a license is taking a hunter's education safety course. Certain states require different things for non-residents, mm -hmm. but uh, starting you know, June 30th, 1979, you have to have it to be able to get a hunting license. The Berkeley County Sheriff Department hosted one of these classes with the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources last week that was ahead of deer season. And yes, it's a lot of young people enrolled in the course, but the ages do vary. Of course, you see a lot right before the age of 16 mm -hmm. because you know at 16 in South Carolina, you got to have a hunting license and you got to have this course uh, to be able to get a hunting license. These courses are free if you show up in person, and it may feel like they're based just for hunters because of the name, but they are not just a hunter's only club. We want everybody to come because not only does it teach you about uh, the ethics of hunting, but it also teaches you about firearms and many other safety uh, features that you can carry on in life when you're handling a firearm. I took my hunter education safety course when I was about 13 and sitting in on the class in Berkeley last week was refreshing and very informative because there's so much more that goes into hunting. You teach them a lot about ethics, uh, not only to hunter to hunter, but also to people that do not hunt. And then you also teach them a lot about firearms. As you've seen today, we did a firearm presentation, me and Officer Harrison that uh, you always treat every firearm like it's loaded at all times. It teaches you about different game and then also tree stand safety and the different types of tree stands. So I think the kids get a lot out of it. But the main thing I really stress is it teaches them a lot about ethics and conservation because we don't have conservation, then we won't have wildlife for future generations. For this week's Hunt, Hook and Cook, I'm Brianne Welch.